the lost civilization of Kremuria. The untold story. The forgotten empire. Introduction. In the heart of Fontaine, long before the reign of Parasite Welcome. Hicheria, there was a civilization unlike any other. This was Tremuria, a land ruled by the enigmatic and powerful cult King Remus. A golden age that began with divine creation and ended in cataclysm destruction. What happened truly happened to this forgotten empire? Why did it rise so high only to be swelled? By the deities. Join us as we uncover the mysteries and tragedies of Remuria, the most civilization. The Gamuria, the heaven placed era. For Remuria, there was an age known as the heaven placed reign, an era of divine rule that lasts for countless generations. The people of his era live under the watchful eyes of celestial and voice, who is king in the blessing of eternity. But as time moved on, they grew restless, yearning for freedoms never promised by the heavens. The rebellion was met with the fury of the gods. Gigantic waves and relentless rain the wipe out cities and drown the scene of mankind. The flyforous birds scattered, leaving as wild animals, shown of knowledge and wisdom until a new order could rise. The rise of Ramuria, the golden god king. From the ashes of this primordial chaos, Kemuria was born, founded by Rims, the golden god king. Ramuria was beacon of civilization in a war still reeling from divine bed. Remus descended upon Merobis in his golden ship, Fortuna, bringing with him the gift of agriculture, architecture, music, and art. His vision transformed the wild plains of Fontaine into a thriving empire, with its capital, Capitolium, at the heart of this new golden empire. The Splendor of Ramuria A City of Wonders Enter Ramuria was to step into a dream The towering Russian pillars and the Grand Royal Fairways fled to the port of Fortuna Where the Imperial ship took The city itself was parfell of architecture with giant calf rock forming green temples, arena and markets overflowing with treasures from around the world. Apitalium, the crown jewel of the Muria, was a paradise for artists and intellectuals, where beauty and wisdom were reserved above all. The Golden Peach of the Muria, a symphony of harmony. Famous it is wisdom, appointed for exceptional humans as Harmos, sharing his divine power to maintain the delicate harmony of his empire. Under his rule, Kamuria expanded its influence, conquering these dun lands and even subduing the great dragon beneath the official deck. But this expansion came at a cost. As Remuria grew, so did its Arabans and descendants, sowing the seeds of its eventual downfall. The fall and decline of Remuria entered a cataclysm. Remuria's cult of kids was not to less. No one's harmonious empire descended into chaos as power corrupted the mind of its leader. Rebellion grew among those who had yet to be conquered, and the great storms, possibly the abyss itself, swept across the land, obliterating in its path. The once mighty city of Capitolium was swallowed by the earth, 
its current temple and royal fairway straightens to ruins. The people of Remuria along with their glorious civilization were lost to history, leaving only fragmented memories and ancient ruins. The aftermath, column and the lost knowledge. In a week of Remuria destruction, its survivors were transformed into this figured column, cursed to winter the land, waiting for their kingdom to rise again. The knowledge and wisdom of Remuria were either lost or deliberately distorted by those who claimed to be his descendant. The Land Street Empire became the staff of legend. Its true history with and with the sand of time. With use the cozy to the fall of the Harmus. Among the tragic figures of Ramuria, final days were Odius and Cosi Totor. Two who had risen from humble beginning the position of great power. Their friendship was tested by the chaos that engulfed their empire, leading to their divide. Odius, haunted by compassion and regret, halted ignored the suffering caused by Ramuria conquest. Thus you do on the other hand, live in the ruthless elimination of all who opposed the golden order. Bear conflicting views mirror the plot the collapse of Remuria as the empire leaders turn against each other in desperate need to save the what remain. I got the essence of the Remuria power. At the end of Remuria, rise and fall was Iker, a mysterious substance created by Remus itself. Live to grant eternal life and wisdom, Iker was the foundation of Remuria's power, yet it also carried a curse as the golden Iker slowly corroded, turning into source of mythos and chaos. In the final days of Remuria, this substance becomes a symbol of the Empire Hapris. As even its creator would not control the forces he had unleashed. Conclusion The story of Ramuria is one of billions a tragedy of a civilization that reached for the heavens and was prolonged by its low ambition. As we explore the ruins of this lost empire, we are reminded of the fragility of even the greatest civilization. What lesson can we learn from Raburia? I ask. And could its fate when they be our own? Join the discussion and let's uncover the truth together. Leave a comment in the description. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the lost history of Raburia. If you enjoyed this deep dive into Fontaine's Forgotten Empire, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out life adventure into the mysteries of this world. Share your talk and theories in the comment below. And let's keep conversation going. Until next time, stay curious.